words of our divine mother from the book words of the mother volume 14 page 151 topic openness and receptivity openness our divine mother says openness is the will to receive and to utilize for progress the force and influence the constant aspiration to remain in touch with the consciousness the faith that the force and consciousness are always with you around you inside you and that you have only to let nothing stand in the way of your receiving them opening says our divine mother opening is a release of the consciousness by which it begins to admit into itself the workings of the divine light and power open to the consciousness which is working on and in you and keep always as quiet and peaceful as you can I pray that I may serve you consciously and sincerely without the least encroachment or hampering by the ego and be inspired by you in everything says a sadhak for this the divine mother says open yourself more and more to the consciousness and you will receive inspiration our divine mother says the opening to the divine light cannot be made through coercion Our divine mother says to open more to love and to the light this is exactly the answer i sent to your last letter rise higher in the consciousness love more widely open to the light and all divergences will disappear you must be as vast and comprehensive as a world to do you know yoga if you open yourself to the force and help the help there will be no strain because the help is always there opening is the help which is there constantly in all the domains it is for us to know how to benefit from it a divine mother says integral opening of the being towards the divine is the first step of the ascent next topic wideness Our divine mother says widen yourself to the extreme limit of the universe and beyond always take upon yourself all the necessities of progress and resolve them in the ecstasy of unity then you will be divine let me repeat widen yourself to the extreme limit of the universe and beyond always take upon yourself all the necessities of progress and resolve them in the ecstasy of unity then you will be divine to widen and open as vastly as you can or as one can is more effective than to bring down and to try to push the force into the narrowness of the small human being plasticity our divine mother says Plasticity is always being ready for progress which is demanded. Plasticity is a condition for us to be ready for the progress which is always demanded. Next topic receptivity. Our divine mother says receptivity is the capacity of admitting and retaining the divine workings. Receptivity is the conscious of the divine will and surrender to it. Integral receptivity says our divine mother integral receptivity is a condition in which the whole being is aware of the divine will and obeys it. Psychic receptivity is a condition where the psychic being responds joyously to the ascending force. Mental receptivity is always being ready to learn. Emotional receptivity is when the emotions are wanting to be divinized. Vital receptivity happens only when the vital understands that it must be transformed. The vital blossoms in aspiration for the divine. Physical receptivity is a condition in which one should not have except anything except the divine that is physical receptivity is that which one should not have except towards the divine supramentalized receptivity a divine mother says it is a receptivity of tomorrow 
it is the widening of the consciousness and the one pointedness of the aspiration that the receptivity increases by revolt and our divine mother says by revolt the doors of receptivity are closed in order to be filled anew the vessel must get empty sometimes it is when we are preparing for greater receptivities that we feel empty consciousness be receptive it is there love and blessings our divine mother says try to be satisfied with what you receive for it is the matter of receptivity because you can believe me i give always much more than what the people are capable of receiving and in 2 or 3 minutes they could have quite enough to go for a whole month but the mind interferes with its ignorant demands and the whole thing is spoiled my love is always with you if then you do not feel it it is because you are not capable of receiving it it is your receptivity that is lacking and should be increased for this you must open yourself and one opens oneself only if one gives oneself surely you are trying more or less consciously to draw the forces and the divine love towards you the method is bad give yourself without calculating and without expecting anything in return and then you will become capable of receiving let me repeat the sentence give yourself without calculating without expecting anything in return from the divine and then you will be capable of receiving question sweet mother how can we know that we are receptive for that our divine mother says when we feel the urge to give and the joy of giving to the divine's work then we can be sure that we have become receptive to be receptive our divine mother says to be receptive is to feel the urge to give and the joy of giving to the divine's work all one has all one is all one does these are the golden words of our divine mother Sale 